Hello, it's the Jack again bringing you a Supreme Commander 2 game after about a week or so. And it's a 1v1 against Dark, who's also in the channel. Hi! Last build. How interesting, we're both Cybran. This could be an amusing game. Uh, yes, it could be. Hopefully I won't be feeling in my last 1v1 against you, where you just pretty much walked over me, didn't you? Damn Eon and your hover tanks. <laughs> Are we taking the other two pylons of mass? And a 1v1 on this map? Nope, they're off limits. You can build other structures there, but just not mass points. Alright. Just store all my power gens then up there. Pretty much. Secret power forming converters. <laughs> <laughs> You'll never see it coming. Nope. <laughs> if only Cybran had a uh, mega fortresses. We just see this swarm of planes come from the uh, empty ground. How? Did you do what? Ha? What? It'd be brilliant. I'm almost certain you're going to mix land and air. Maybe, maybe not. You do like doing to... it. I have to keep you on your toes. Worst comes at worst. Adapters! Yeah! Uh, the anti everything. Pretty much. Pretty much. What they need is a direct fire gun, and you won't need anything else for the Cybrans. <laughs> it's very true, it's probably a good thing why they don't have it. Mm. Yeah, I know it's risky, but... He might not expect a long radar, and I might see what he's doing without him knowing it. It's an idea, anyway. See what he's doing. He's got there, there, there. I still can't see his back base, but at least I can see all the way down here and all the way up here. So I have a hard time sneaking things around me. For a full on mix of Brackman and Loyalists. With any luck, it'll be worthwhile. And I may be actually be able to get in there before he starts building up. Training in their fire rate, actually. Yeah, he's retreating. Can I? No, I cannot. Yeah. Oh god, he's got Blackman as well. Well, there goes that plan. I'm way now, now. on my factories. Not quite you. And get ahead of yourself. Well, I was trying to sneak up on you, but... You kind of saw it coming, so I couldn't get that free kill. I did try, though. Ah. Uh. The mass, it be mine. Now, now. Going. 
Yeah, you know who that is. I saw him pushing stuff I don't. You know, I was trying to build a shield in that, but clearly I don't have enough. Bah, dear. Oh, I'm surprised I held that off. Com repair rate was just keeping that alive. Yeah, never so often I dive in my land force just to try and distract your fire as you make it around. That went well for me at least. Two for one deal. God, <laughs> oil. I got the black man. Really? The attack missile launcher upgrade on your comm? You, you're going for overcharge! No. In a 1v1 game, that'd be suicide. Must make sure your comm dies. God. I'm glad I noticed that attack so long or else I would have left your calm alone. I don't even know the range on it, because it doesn't it doesn't increase the range bounds. Trees, things. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, so Come on, why didn't you coming? Uh, you called me out on my strategy as soon as I did it. <laughs> I did that to a lobster and he just turned in and called me a massive cunt. It was brilliant. I think you're going to mix land and then. I quickly went to my engineer who was about to build an air factory to cancel it and you already started. <laughs> uh, I'm glad I got vengeance after the last game though. <laughs> I have to say there was no mercy in this game at all. Really? Your your comm and your entire land force charging down on me. Yeah. 
<laughs> well, there you go. A game after about a weekend. I did fairly well. I called him out on the strategy straight away and he's not amused by that. You can check out my channel for more and you can also subscribe. So, yeah.